and the commencement of the five-day warning strike by members of the Nigerian Association of Resident Doctors across the country is already taking its toll on medical activities. The president of the Association of Resident Doctors, ARD, at the University of Ilori Teaching Hospital, Dr. Ijaya Mubarak, in an exclusive interview with our correspondent, said the ARD members were complying totally with the directive of its national body. It's the issue of 15% uh, for the health budget, which was approved and agreed in 2001 during the Abuja Declaration. Even this current budget now, I think is a 5 point something percent. So we are telling government to do the needful by going with the agreement they did in 2001 about And this will go a long way to assist the sector, not just with the doctors alone. Because it, it, it will improve the infrastructure within the hospital. It will improve medicine and uh, service delivery as well. Dr. Mubarak slammed the bill seeking to compel medical and dental graduates to render five year, a five-year compulsory service in Nigeria before being granted license to practice. The bill is funny in the sense that uh, doing that, it, 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 it even made people not even want to stay. That would mean as a student, I'm aspiring to be a doctor, I can try to go and do other, other courses. So I feel the Honorable that sponsored the bill did a uh, poor work at uh, that. They should sponsor, sponsor a better bill that will improve service delivery and also make the environment enabling for people to work. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.